I'm Anil Kumar. We need to find the angle X, Y, Z in the given diagram. You can pause the video, answer the question, and then look into my suggestions. You should note that here we have 90 degrees. That is to say that X and 60 degrees angle form 90 degrees. They are complementary angles, right? So we can say that X plus 60 degrees is equal to 90 degrees and therefore x is equal to 90 degrees take away 60 degrees that gives us a value of 30 degrees so this angle is 30 degrees for us now we are given exterior angle of 110 degrees how can we utilize this angle of 110 degrees well this exterior angle is sum of these two angles. So that's the way we could use it. The other way is it is also vertically opposite to this angle. So that angle also here will be 110 degrees. Correct? These are vertically opposite angles. They are always equal. Right? Now it is simpler. Since we know these two angles, in this triangle, we can find Z, right? So Z should be equal to how much? Total is 180. So all we'll start with 180 degrees and take away other angles. So in this case, 110, take away 30 degrees, right? So when you take away 110 from 180, you get 70. Take away 30 is 40 degrees. You can use calculator also to solve. Okay, so we get 40 degrees. Once you have Z as 40 degrees, you can find what Y is. What should be Y? Y should be equal to, look at the big triangle, right? The big triangle, so it is 180 degrees minus this 90 degrees, right? And minus 40 degrees. 180 minus 90 is 90. 90 minus 40 is 50 degrees. So we get Y as equal to 50 degrees. So that is how you can easily calculate all the angles in the given diagram. I'm Anil Kumar and I hope that helps. You can always share and subscribe my videos. Thank you and all the best.